there's still some more actions that the government needs to take to to get it get get it there, right? You know, uh, on one hand, we see a tremendous uh, uh, momentum since January uh, when the central bank uh, launched the digital yuan app. Uh, uh, within a, a month, you know, there's more than 30 million downloads, uh, but you still have one billion internet users to conquer, right? So, so, so that means, on the other hand. Uh, the uh, the central banks and the governments still need to find more creative ways to get people to use them. And now, now don't forget, right? WeChat started a red envelope uh, uh, distribution gifting uh, many uh, a few years ago. Uh, the, you know, WeChat used the Spring Festival to hand out uh, 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 red envelopes with digital money, and uh, which enticed all the users to use them. And now the Winter Olympics provide a new context. To, to, to create that uh, attention in, in the public. And hopefully this can uh, bring more interests of the public into the digital currency usage. All right. Winston, one, one quick final word on the CBDC. I'm sure that this digital yuan in the long term is not simply positioned as a payments mechanism, as an alternative payments channel for Chinese consumers. What do you think the central bank's ultimate plan is for this? Yeah. Uh, I think the ultimate plan is to is to integrate the digital currency into the industries, into the to be market. You know, uh, for for the last uh, two years, we mostly saw testing of the digital currency in the to see consumer context, right? Uh, and, and even including the Winter Olympics, it's mostly about uh, the foreign visitors uh, using digital currency without the need of a Chinese bank account. You know, I, I think up to now. Uh, the, the, the test about to, to see consumer usage of the digital currency has been uh, mostly there. Uh, but for the next, next phase, I, I, I trust the central bank will move the test further into the business industry context so that going forward, the digital currency can also be an integral part of the overall industry economy.